Oh, well, the old man, he was chuffed about it. Yeah, I bet he was. I bet he was. Yeah. Right, so where did we leave off last time? We, You've been captured, haven't you? I've been captured. You've been captured and, at Merville. Uh, told to sit by the wall yeah. while the advancing German troops went into the town. Right, Merville. Merville. Right. Yes. And uh, it began to get cold. Now, this is where, this is the end. I told I told you about the the, the grenade. Yeah, we have got. I bought one in. Look, that's it. That's look at it. that. Tater that, masher. You got it. But this yeah. one, this one I had. Yeah. Uh, uh, this one, the German. It, it was uh, carved. Oh, okay. Bit yeah, well, peacetime. You see. Oh, the, okay. The, 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 this one, the later one. Was all night. Oh, right. Oh, they okay. Were. All oh, right. But it was later on in the war when right. they're made from tin. <laughs> yeah, well, that one I just picked up uh, years and years ago from, yeah. uh, from and it is, some it is. military sh and you see, shop or something, anyway. Uh, there's, there's a, no, 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 you do it. There, there's, there's a, a little, screw there. There is. You undo, undo that and you'll see there's a porcelain ball in the... In the there you go. That. Yeah. <laughs> That's exactly what happens. It's a good, I never saw them because they were behind me. Yeah. It's a, it's a damn good job you was actually sat underneath that corrugated zinc, isn't it? Yeah. Saved you. Yeah. Yeah. It was, uh, the co I never noticed the fucking zinc because it was in the fucking edge. Ah, right. You see, they yeah. were coming from the, the southeast. Yeah. I'd got my fucking gun, and according to the officer, you know. As Mr. you said, Smith yeah. From Pointing the wrong way. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, you you're saying that you was laid down and after you sort of got got the Germans around you and um, you was laid against this wall. Yeah. Was you there for a long time? Bef five and a half hours. Was I you? remember the five and a half hours. It was getting there. Oh, I don't know, eleven o'clock, and uh, the the men had been gone about an hour. Uh huh. Yeah. And uh, they said, uh, uh, Mr. Smith, oh, Lieutenant Smith said, "What we'll do, Jackson?" He said. Uh, We'll go to the southeast, he said, and surround them. Yeah. Now, one bloke couldn't have known his southeast from the southwest. They went the other fucking way. <laughs> and I said they went into the, the, the centre of France, down to, how can I put it, uh, well, well past fucking Dunkirk, anyway. Oh, OK. Yeah. And uh, yeah. I, I always say with somebody who, who got a better memory than me, yeah. Stan Wilson. Well, it was a long time ago, wasn't it? I yeah, mean, it was, it was. 82 years yeah. ago, really. But, you know, and then I was cold. Yeah. Fucking cold. And then this guard who was over me. Yeah. Uh, I thought, well, fuck me now. I began to shiver. It was getting late evening. So you had no grey coat or anything like that? Just no, it, no, it was in the barn. Oh, right. And so all were. their gear, mm. you know, great coats, all fucking stuff. And as soon as they they pinched on their fucking way, <laughs> I'll tell you. Yeah. And where uh, this is how that he pulled this fucking SS man. I didn't know the SS from the fucking HYZ. No. <laughs> I didn't know, I didn't. No. And he said, uh, what is Lewis? I said, you can't, because you can see I was only a youngster. Yeah. Well, but always, no. Two minutes, five minutes. I thought, well, that's fucking clear enough. And I went in there and I knew where I'd put my fucking gear. Yeah. And I bought my haversack, which said, fuck all in any of this bits of, of uh, shaving gear, you know. Yeah. And uh, my, my great coat. I was all glad for that great coat right. throughout the war. I, I bet. Now, although the Red Cross did supply yeah. uh, lots of. Yeah. Great coats, you know, no emblems on them, but you know. You said that um, when you were obviously down by that wall, that some other POWs started to arrive as well. That was about eight, up at eight at night. Right. Then they came, and I could hear them bang, boom, crack, what? Right. It wasn't the infantry. No. <laughs> it was a fucking attack. Oh, okay, right. And they, they played fucking hell, and they marched, there's about half a dozen of all them. Yeah. And they marched them up from Merville, which is only about ten minutes or so, to where I was. Because mm -hmm. this barn was huge, huge. Yeah. 
what um, from there? Yes. Where did you go from there? Um, from from near Mayor Right now, that's just, uh, to get that same night. Yeah, must have been about ten o'clock when we set off, and one boat. Uh, there wasn't anybody I knew. I mean, I was the only fucking captain there was. But was a nice body, but father. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, this is true, this is. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I thought, and you know, was, uh, I fucking shed tears. And I'll tell you why. We had nothing to eat for about a day and a half. Yeah. Water was in short supply. We'd gone to a place called. Uh, oh dear, 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 dear. Well, anyway, uh, another small town. Yeah. And where did they put us up for the night? And they must have been, they must have collected about a hundred and fifty, not all from Mayville, you know. Yeah, well, from all over. Uh, yeah, and yeah. and shoved them, shoved us in this prison. Okay. And the urinal was in the middle of the fucking chewings. All right. You know, that's where you had a piss. Right. You know, there's right. no. No, a French jail. So you got about 150 guys w with you. Yeah. All different regiments. Yeah. Not one Lincolnshire bloke of them. Really? That's right. And I'll tell you this. Truthfully, I would have a tear in my eye now. I'll tell you what, why the tears came. I'd lost all my mates. Right. Yeah, so you know, cool. Yeah, you And you, you really, really were on your fucking job. Uh, really yeah, on, on your, your job. Yeah. Jokes. And for a young man, it would have been quite worrying, wouldn't yeah, it? Oh, I'll tell you what, it was a shaker. Yeah. You think you're as brave as the next? Yeah. You're anything but me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm talking about me, no one else. Mm. <laughs> I remember the, when we got, get up in the morning, you never slept. No. You see. Uh, we had our tin hats as well. The tin hat was a pillar. <laughs> and no blankets, fuck all. Right. And I got my coat. Yeah. A bloke said, can I come under there with you? I said, you fuck off, mate. But I was beginning to realise then that this is a new sort of life. Yeah. You either stick up for yourself or you'll get, and, and that's true. Yeah. And you managed to keep that grey coat for the rest I did. of the and for the rest of the war. Well done. <laughs> and I did, that's the truth. I All did. Right. Yeah. Did but hey, hey. When you were when Tria, why is in my in my head? Yeah. You said where did you go from um, uh, to Tria? We got to this place which I'll remember uh -huh. a little later on. And we uh, had to go about another hundred kilometres. And we finished up on the German border. If you have a look on the map, it's a wine growing uh, area, Trier. Okay. T R I E R, Trier. Oh, right. And uh, you can imagine, I mean, German soldiers there. And, uh, you know, they were swearing, calling us all sorts of names. Because they'd go for for London tunic. What's this tunic? Prick. Oh, right. <laughs> You're starting to learn a few German true? words. Hey? You're starting to learn a few German words. Then. Yeah, yeah. Quite, quite oh, soon. Oh, he hadn't taught me that one, <laughs> Mickey. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> cut this story not short, but relevancy, in relevancy. Yeah. There was about, they gathered up somewhere around about half a million frogs. I'm not joking. Right. I mean, where where we pitched their fucking gear from? Mm -hmm. uh, in in a big field, pitching down with rain. Right. They went into captivity with fucking suitcases, army oh. uniform, okay. suitcase. Right. Full of food, water. Really. Well, what do you think men do? Well, yeah, yeah. But anyway, there was a big fight, was and it? the Germans, you know, fired a few fucking machine gun bullets, and it stopped. Right. But then. We were loaded on to these trucks. Uh, on the trains? On the trains. Oh, the 40 and 8s, as you were saying. Eh? The 40 and 8s. Yeah. 40, 40 Homs or 8 Chevro. Yeah. 8 horses. 8 horses. Yeah. It's... And was you absolutely rammed in yeah. solid? Well, yeah. You, yeah. You, you know, 40. There yeah. must have been 50 in them. Yeah. And, uh, you know... I don't know how Whereabouts was that, Stan? Whereabouts did you get the train? Trier. At Trier. It was Trier. at Trier. Right. I remember we went across country. Yeah. 
and into Silesia. Right. You know, and right. that's the sort of bloody Germany near Czechoslovakia. Because um, obviously you captured. What date was you captured? Twenty seventh. Twenty seventh of May. And, and and it was then middle of June. Yes, and then it was because um, there is a photograph, isn't there? Of, hmm? um, there's, a, there's a document of you with your photograph taken. Yes. When you arrived at Lambsdorff. With a number on it. With a number on it, yeah. Yeah, exactly. In early, early June, wasn't it? Yeah. So I think, I think I calculated it was 18 days you were travelling. Before, well, 18 that's days. That's about it. Yeah. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah. 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 And that was all on train or did you have to walk any now, parts? Uh, now, from Korea, yeah. we disembarked at uh, Lambsdorff. Oh, okay. See what I mean? Yeah. And we got off. Yeah. And... Uh, uh, it took a day and a bit, you did, know. Did, oh, right, not too, well, day and a bit, so it's not too bad, I suppose. No, no. Did but it stop at all, anyway? I guess, hey? did it stop and look, let you out for any reason at all, you know? No. To, no toilet stops? No, you were locked <laughs> in there, you okay. know, with these, where well, they used to have me. Yeah. Yes. But defecation. Yeah. And urination. Yeah. You never smoked anything like it in no. your life. No. no. By God. I remember this bloke said, I've, I've been in, in some p <coughs> queer positions in my time. Mm. But he said, that smell is terrible. Yeah. 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 Well, I said, look, what they've been eating, mm. same as the rest of us, nothing. Did did the train actually go right into Lambsdorff, the town? Because Lambsdorff no, was uh, a town. Uh, it's just like, I would say you could say, with all honesty, mm -hmm. good fella school would be the... Uh, okay. And uh, when you got to uh, right, so that's probably yeah. about a mile and a half. Yeah, yeah, so about a mile. And, and then you did all told to get off, and the then Ger the German guards wouldn't come anywhere near us. To no, drink. really, they had all messed themselves, you know. All the way. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And what do you think the first fucking job we had when we got here? You know, they lined us all up. Yeah. This is interesting. It really is interesting. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's all interesting. Yeah. Well. Yeah. And, uh, I, you know, Mickey said, uh, oh, we've got to muck in. Well, muck in means be mates, you know. Okay. Uh, oh, you, you, you can't do everything by yourself. So you, you'd obviously, you met this other POW on the train or yeah. wherever, and you'd, you'd sort of knew that you'd best sort of stick together. Mm. And he, what was his name, sorry? Mickey or Michael Krieger. Okay. He's on that fucking photo, I think. Yeah, we'll have a look at that. I'm just going to get this up. Oh, hang on. We've got quite a few photographs on here, haven't we? Yeah. Let's have a look, see if I can stand that up. That's a lovely looking bastard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not working. So, here's, here we are, look. I'll come and sit around here with you a bit, Stan, and we can look at this together. So this is be the main gate of Lambsdorff, was That's it? correct, yes, 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 yeah. yes. And that's how you remember it? Yes, that's how, uh, exactly how I remember it. Is it? Yeah. There's the fucking bushes up there with their machine guns. <laughs> and look at all the fucking queer fellas. Yeah. I don't know which... Oh, there's a there's a photograph probably taken somewhere. Because you're on that oh, one no, as well, Mickey, aren't you? No, Mickey isn't on there. No. Now, I'm just trying to think where that was. Fly well now. What's it going to be? It's Sudatenland. Sudatenland, that's Sudatenland. it. Sudatenland, that's it. Yeah, Fry Valdo, look. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and uh, we were all corporals then. Oh, right. All corporals. <laughs> <laughs> Equality. If you got a, uh, if you, one bloke in, uh, the, you know, the, uh, uh, those that had a skill. Yeah. Or grabbed by the Germans and what that. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. uh <coughs> The uh, some bloke said, "Look, there's a special camps for corporals." I said, "For corporals?" I said, "Sergeants or sergeant majors?" Yeah. No, he said, "You can't, and they for you know they're better accommodation." Oh, okay, right. So you all. It's true. But you all upgraded oh, yourself, true. did you? So <laughs> promoted yourself. We all look great, and uh, one of the Welshmen there, he said, yeah. uh, "All the." Uh, that's him. Okay. He, yeah. About half a dozen of them were Welsh. He's one. He was my mate. 
Biggest double crosser I've ever had. Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> now, we're down to now, you know, mm. Mickey, Mickey is l long gone, you know. Uh, yeah. I mean, you could have a job, and if there's 50 in the camp, right. and uh, w what happens, and I'm sure you understand it, having worked for your living, if they hadn't got, actually got two, with the Germans thought you got too many men, there on the job, they'd take and put them on. Right, yeah, I'm with you, yeah, yeah. We've got some other photographs. Hey, I've got some other photographs there, Stan, that we've sort of got off the internet. Um, sorry, yes, uh, I don't know if you recognize any of that, do you? I really don't. You know, I don't know, it's some sort of there's a bunk, some, some sort of living quarters, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, they are. There's a, there's another one. Look. That's them on the fucking parade ground. Yeah. How long was you at Lambsdorff before you was um, sent out? Sent out to a work camp. Three weeks. Three weeks. Right. Well, you, you see, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, apparently, yeah. it was a prisoner of war camp in the fourteen eighteen war. Yes, it was. Yeah, it was. I'm just trying to find. You've got some lovely stuff there. Yeah, well, I've got it all off the internet, to be honest. But I'm trying to find a photograph. You don't mind me having my little drink you, there. <laughs> not at all. I'm not a drinker, a drunkard. No, it just helps, doesn't it? Uh, we've got one of you where um, you had your photograph taken quite early on, didn't you? Here we are, it's up here. Yeah, I did. Here we are. Right, then... We'll, so when you arrived at Lambsdorff, how long do you think it was before you had your ID papers and everything sorted out like this? Because we've got a photograph here. Oh, about three weeks. Two, some. I'm going to just show this photograph of you. Yeah. 20-year-old Stan Jackson with his POW number 10580. That's correct. Hey? He's I'm a good-looking chap then, wasn't you? Hey? I say he was a good-looking young man then. You got looks plenty of hair on. <laughs> You're probably in desperate need of a haircut. They could have got a vicious too. <laughs> <laughs> and your fing fingerprints taken. Yeah. It's got you down here, look, as being blonde. I thought when I saw these, I thought, fucking no, like, <laughs> ages, mate, got a good bloody doing yeah. there. I'm going to say, I'm not going to take the credit for finding all this information. Eddie um, Finch, who uh, yeah. does a lot of research yeah. for military, he, he actually went to the archives, National Archives, and got all this sort of thing. Yeah. But it's, it's quite unusual to actually find a photograph uh, because a lot of these identification cards got destroyed. Apparently, a lot of the POWs, when they were liberated, did destroy a lot of them. Did went they? into the offices and, and destroyed a lot of it. But some some were saved. Unfortunately, yours was as well. I was more interested in getting home. Yeah. Because I was just, yeah. the bones were coming out of my fucking rib. 